Hey everybody, this is Bitchin' and Prayin'. Sorry about the glare on that side. I kept moving stuff over, but I don't have long curtains there and it's making a glare. Um, this is a quick food haul um, from a drive through food initiative slash pantry. You've seen me go to uh, show ones from this one before. I was lucky enough to get there while they still had stuff. I was in the area. It is still considered my area, but out where I'm at, there isn't exactly where they have these. So, but they, it's for a, you know, it's considered my area. Um, I was in that part of that town, and um, they have it once a month. A lot of times, I can't make it to it, and I hadn't been there in a while. And it's not worth gas to drive all the way there, but I, if I can, like not working that day, not have something going on, and there's stuff that I can do that make it worth the gas money to be there, like other errands or visiting or whatever, works out great. Um, I did get in line early because there, you know, there ends up being a line. Um, so I was there about an hour before they started, and they came around and said, hey, there's a truck that pulled in. That somebody brought a lot of produce. If you have your own bag, you can go over there. I did get the three carrots and the three apples. Um, they did have some little pumpkins, like they almost look like squash, but they look like pumpkins. They were small, but they only had a few of those. And some of these ladies look like they really wanted them, so I didn't grab one. I left them for them. So these were off a truck that pulled in. Um, and then they had rice, split peas, which would be nice because I have some ham bones in the refrigerator, not the refrigerator, the freezer. The onions were, now sometimes with this, I think you've seen me with this before if you watch my videos, um, these onions almost look a little moldy. And especially in the winter, they freeze. Or in the summer, that everything gets real hot in the trucks. They're in the boxes. These boxes are in these sealed boxes it's from the food bank, I think. Um, so like this, but I'll peel them. I'll get them used up. I will peel those. I will chop them up, use them fresh. I'll peel them and I'll saute them. I'll put them in things. They'll get used. It's not going to kill us. Watch next next video. But your brain is not here anymore. Um, no, they'll be fine. I'll make sure every bad part's cut off. Um, potatoes are looking good this time. Last time they had some a lot of mold on them. Um, only, actually, only a couple were good. These look good. It's a five pound bag. It's a five pound bag of uh, apples. Those look good. And not frozen. Those look good. A gallon of milk. Um, that's got like a a week on it, at least a, over a week left on it. That's good. Uh, two percent. That's what we use too. Um, and a locally grown. Um, I think maybe a farmer donated or they got deals from. It was not in the box. It was separate. They were passing them out. I don't know if they got a deal on it or if it was donated. But it's a locally grown meat. Not right next to this area or anything. But like within the southwest Michigan area there. Um, ground beef. Very nice. Um, and then Blue Diamond almonds. Snickerdoodle flavored. Well, I'm staying away from the almonds because this morning was when I had that crown put on. Perm the permanent crown. And I had to pay that last payment. Hence... Well, I really need to be hitting more of these if I can find them. I, I've, you've heard me whine about all the different things that have gone on, but why I still consider myself fortunate because there's people going through tons worse, worse but I'm getting a little worried about our finances with things keep happening and happening and happening, but um, I'm still worried about this crown doesn't feel right. And then he started like going on my top tooth. That's not anything wrong with it to make it like even it up a little bit. So it wasn't hitting the bottom tooth because he kept doing that one and it kept hitting anyhow. And I was like, do not crack that top tooth. I have no more money to give you. And um, he's like, I'm just dusting it. And I was like, oh my goodness. And I, I was freaking out. Um, Anyhow. So yeah, after that payment, <clears throat> we needed this even more. But um, so yeah. So I was thinking I had a casserole I made and I couldn't afford the um, almonds because they're pricey in the store I maybe I should take a portion of these out wash them to get the snickerdoodle flavor out 
let them dry and then freeze them. So next time I have the casserole, I can take them out and then sliver them or chop them. There's supposed to be slivered almonds in the casserole, but I can chop them up or something like that. Just make sure my nut allergy grandchild doesn't get a hold of the casserole. Then I can have almonds for that casserole. Just don't want them to taste like snickerdoodle, but Sasquatch might like these. Um, some of the kids might like them. Um, I can put them out on little charcuterie, charcuterie board if I make it. Um, anyhow, yeah, they'll be good. That's really nice. Nice little treat there. Um, so anyhow, we had the milk, the almonds, the beef, uh, the loose vegetables, the bag of potatoes and apples. We have uh, dried peas and rice and then the bag of onions. It's real nice. Real nice little haul here and just a, a blessing. We're very happy to have it. Um, and happy that I was able to be there to grab it. And, um, and it looks like there was, everybody got it. And, um, as I was turning out of it and coming back around, I had to stop at another place by there and came back by people were still pulling in, um, a half hour later and there was still stuff. So people were still getting it. You just never know. And like I said, I just got there early since I had planned all my stuff around going there. Um, so yeah. Thank you for watching everybody. And I hope you're having a great day and a blessed day and bless somebody else when you can. And uh, God will provide. Talk to you later. And this is Fitch and Pray and give it a like and a share and do not forget to subscribe.